champion of the world, introducing 54 Milagros, Jordanis Uga. And his opponent across the ring, the defending world champion fighting out of the blue corner. Wearing white trunks with red and green trim, fighting out of him proudly, representing his home of Dallas, Texas. He weighed in at a ready 146 and one quarter pounds, truly one of the stars of boxing today, and pound for pound greats. He is undefeated in his campaign in the ring with a record of 24 wins, no losses, 21 wins coming by way of knockout. Tonight, he also is risking his untarnished record and is making the third defense of his title. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the hard-hitting, reigning and defending, undefeated IBF welterweight champion of the world, introducing the truth, Errol Spence Jr. Right hand to the bottom, thin, like you said, Joey Stringbean. And the right hand, and the left, and the right hand. And there it is. Vargas goes to the canvas. Knocked down for Spence. Seven here in round two. Former Olympic medalist. <laughs> Looked like Udak came out with a little purpose walking forward. That's right. Mean that and a good shot to the body. Productive, effective aggression. Not just walking forward. Uh, there is in that belt line of Jamal James. I had James winning the first round again, I think. Yes. There's a man hanging on right now, Ray Leonard. Well, the thing. What's the biggest thing you would tell Spence right? Unanimous decision. It's gotta be Rust early on. He jumped in to deliver those punches. Could have been an opportunity to that angle. Yeah, to my point, it's not about punches, it's about. How quickly people forget, remember? Going nice to the body. And those spits comes down off his toes. And towards the the numbers, showing the edge towards the smaller man. Hector Mercedes. And the place called the egg. Yeah, the, the egg. Push. The egg. Yeah, Pirates of the egg. Derek James has taught him well. Very well. Body shot will be the call for him. You were talking about there a couple times. Like Dave Jaco there. He's more of a, a sitting target for these body shots who are coming at angles and work the jab. You guys get away from the gymnastics and swim yeah. and find it elsewhere deeper in there. Now he goes up top and the referee moves in and stops it. That is it. Uh, the true Smith Jr. finishes. That solid work this round by Ugas. Yeah, good finish to it as well. To America. That is their championship in sight. Sam Vargas. He worked the body, then goes up top. You know, if you're in the corner of Phil Love Record, you got to be happy with how that first round went. He went oh, 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 he had beaten Lennox Lewis, he beat Riddick. Again, he, once he hit the shores, that one can take a little step out so the taller man can't work. With another body punch. That's the thing we shouldn't miss by right hand, even though it's a little shorter. Get it there. Side. That looks like Ugar's trying to set up a right hand again there. Let's see who's coming. He happy with how that first round went. He made some good shots, but uh, you know. you hear the word from Spencer's part of a double up on those blows, which he's been doing. Oh, Carmel guys is in there. You know, he's been true throughout the second half of this fight is, is that James. Again, a little subtle thing. He allowed James, he sat in the pocket to in some time. But he from came James. right doing. As we talked about earlier, back in May 2013, losing that big body shot. Five win fight streak. At 147. Great shot to the middle section. Oh, a right hand. This is not an epic. There's a left to the body by Ugas. Combination by Oop. Go for 10. 
There's that looping right hand again. Now fight scored thus far. You give in all three rounds. And oh, gosh. Oh. Hey, you show me something. You understand? Headshots all inside. And again, Spence to the head. Remaining. Big right by Ugas. In the fight, but not in the fight. But sometimes that can get a little dangerous because, again, I asked. On a minute to go in this 